Hello, I'm Jim Watson, and I'm in the engineering lab here at Logic Supply. Today we're going to show you how to replace or add a micro SD card to your CL200 series system. Before we get started, you're going to need a Phillips head screwdriver. You're going to need the SD card, and it's also always a good idea to have uh, ESD precautions in place. In this case, we have an ESD bracelet that I'm going to apply here, and I'm going to attach myself to a grounding strap. The SD card on the CL200 series is located along the side. If you have a DIN rail clip, it's going to be just below that. It's, it's held in place by a door that is secured with a P1 Phillips fit. Use a hand driver to remove it. If you have a magnetized screwdriver, that makes it a lot easier. To open the door, once the screw is off, simply push on it and the spring will release and push the door out. If this is the first time you're installing an SD card, there will be a blank card inside. This is just a piece of plastic. Make note of the orientation. That's gonna be important when you go to add your card. You can remove this piece of plastic and set it aside. Now it's time to install the SD card. You wanna make sure that the pins are facing down during the install. Simply insert it into the slot and push and just until you feel some resistance. Take your door and go ahead and just insert that right over that slot there and push that into place. The SD card is now locked into place and we're going to re-secure the door using the screw. Now it's important here that we're not gonna over tighten the screw. The door needs to stay flush with the system over tightening the screw can cause the card to have inadequate contact with the board. Now you're ready to use your SD card with your CL200 series system. Thanks for watching.